Uh, you might be familiar with Dracula, of course, but hold on to your funny bone because this is nothing like Bram Stoker's Dracula. No, this is a youth performance company's Dracula the Musical, and as Emmy Roscoe shows us, it is fun for the entire family. Wait, you think I'm handsome? <laughs> That's Dracula the Musical featuring the world's favorite vampire who finally changes for the better in this upbeat spoof of Dracula. I am joined by Jackie Knight, the founder and artistic director of Youth Performance Company. And the, the first thing we want to say is that this is a family friendly fun, that's a lot of Fs, event. <laughs> it is, it's a, it's a great event to bring your family to for Halloween. Um, it's an original production that we created here at Youth Performance Company. Original script, original music, and we have these incredible young artists that are performing their hearts out and really spoofing that story of Dracula. You must understand, Igor suffers from reverse psychology. Reverse <laughs> psychology? <laughs> It's a storyline where Dracula has decided he really needs to get help. He doesn't want to bite people anymore. And so he brings in a psychologist to come and help him. And well, the first step is realizing that you need help. Absolutely, absolutely. And so that's when the uh, fun ensues. It's, a, it's just a fun time for all families, all ages. Not too scary. It's recommended for ages seven and up. Mm -hmm. But we've had many people say younger, even yeah. younger would enjoy it. One faithful day. On the first day of school, I saw I was to meet some of the youth behind Youth Performance Company. I'm joined by Emma Dalen, who plays Sarah, the heroine of Dracula the Musical. So what, what happens to Sarah on this ride? Um, well, she was hired by Dracula to help him with his psychological problems, and then they fall in love, and his sisters try to turn her into a vampire. <laughs> and how does that work out? Or do you have to come see? You have to come see to find out. You have to come see okay. it. Okay, that is a good deal. So, Dracula, you are played by Alex Garbarino. Um, tell me about this role. This is a classic role, but you guys kind of have a twist on it. Well, since we're kind of going for a spoof instead of a very serious horror genre, it's kind of, you have to act somewhat serious, but also try to make it funny, I guess, as well. So really just try to channel your inner Leslie Nielsen because, I mean, he did a very good Dracula in this. How are audiences responding? Um, so far, they love it. So I guess, we're, I guess we're doing something right. Definitely, there's a lot of energy coming back from the crowd, and I mean, that's really important to us as actors because we kind of feed off of that. And so it's definitely, it's a very responsive crowd, and that's a good thing. Well, very good. I'll let you go suck someone else's blood right now. Uh, but just know that uh, Dracula the Musical is here at the Howard Kahn Fine Arts Center, the intersection of Nicolette and Franklin through